Hi, you're welcome. I'm really glad to have you here. My name is Olamide Adegoke and I speak on relationship, marriage, womanhood, motherhood, Christian lifestyle, everything about women, right? Women health and well-being. And by the grace of God, today I want to share something very important with you. It's actually the strength of women, right? To speak on pains that women go through. I want you to know that women are not weak. The Bible likens us to weaker vessels, but we actually have some strength in us. And there are some things that when it happens to women, they cannot just but feel weak, right? Because of how we are made. And part of those things are what I'll be sharing with you in this video. I want to talk on seven different pains that a woman experiences. If you see any woman, out of ten, at least nine of women would have passed through or experienced, would have experienced this pain I want to talk about in this video. If you are a returning subscriber, I appreciate it. And if you know that you have not subscribed at all, you are seeing my face, please subscribe to this channel. Help me grow this channel. <laughs> right? Please. The first pain that a woman can go, and actually that is what differentiates girls from mature lady or from women, right? The young girl and a mature person. That is menstrual pain. Whew. If you are a woman and you are watching this video and you've never experienced menstrual pain before, I give you kudos. One of the things that makes you know that you are really, really a woman is when you start menstruating and this this comes with pains right from a, during my graduate days this lady in a hostel day that you know she's always in pain at least once a month that time because i did not really have much menstrual pain i was like why is this lady falling sick every now and then every month at least once a month they will have to call her parent, the parent will drive down to school to pick her, you know, take her one, then she will return after a week. I used to imagine, I used to imagine that what is wrong with this girl? Maybe she's a stickler. That was what I thought. Until one day she came out open and she was like, actually, it was menstrual pain, and that's why it used to happen to her every blessed month. I mean, women experience this pain a lot. And if you are a man and you know you have been married and you see your wife say, you know, I'm not fine, I'm having cramps. And you know, this pain comes a lot of with fever, with um stomach aches, back pains, leg pain, and all that. And the funny thing is that there's actually little that you can do to avoid it. It happens almost every night, it's every week you just just take prastamol, just for, for any pain reliever, just for you to get relieved a bit so that is one of the pains that women go through the second pain that women go through let's call it third pain right when a woman loses her virginity at the point of having your first sexual intercourse there is no <laughs> no matter your strength you will feel that pain i feel that every woman should experience that space of life and it's always good that you have it with your mom that is why if you are watching my video now as a young lady i want you to keep your body pure so that when you are experiencing that pain it will be in your husband's house and you know you will know that you are actually a decent lady how losing virginity is not easy right and this pain is experienced once and for all and if you have experienced it you know what i'm saying that it's not easy you know even though it is experienced once but it can take days before it's heal up right i remember when we got married and we wanted to do the half for the first time i think i've shared uh, my experience uh, my, my wedding night i think I've, I've explained it in one of my videos I, i'm going to link it for maybe around here Go around here so that um you can probably watch and learn one or two things so it's also tough 
breaking through might not be easy the first time of trying to do the art so it's a painful experience the, the day that you eventually go through it will be painful so it's a pain that women experience the top kind of pain that women experience is for people uh, mothers and mothers to be right is pregnancy pain ah well by God's grace, I've passed through all this pain that I've been sharing with you. Pregnancy pain is not easy. Now, listen, if you have not gotten pregnant before, let me explain this to you. There are three different uh, phases in pregnancy. It is classified to three. We have the fourth trimester, the second trimester, and the third trimester. Now, the first trimester and the last trimester, they are the top trimesters in the pregnancy journey and luckily for some women they just experience little or no pain ah, i give them kudos the first trimester is always stressful painful because that time the baby is just swimming and there are a lot of changes hormonal changes in the body system the woman can be vomiting so it's all of the pains that women go through and the third trimester this is where the baby has already formed and is just growing they have back pain, leg pain, you know, pelvic pain. It can come anyhow, anyhow. Bodies are different. So it's one of the things that women go through. And that will lead me to the fourth pain. The fourth pain, kind of pain that women experience or women, you know, go experience is a labor pain, right? Oh, my. At least you must have heard of this. A labor is painful. <laughs> <laughs> oh my no matter how easy the experience is i by god's grace i have easy experience you know during labor i and my labor is not that tough but <laughs> it's painful right when the baby is coming it's a painful one right and i really desire that every woman go through this even if you you bore your baby via cesarean session you are still going to experience the pain right if you choose vaginal delivery too it's painful and i think it's good that you experience it <laughs> a fifth kind of pain that women experience is breastfeeding pain right so let's call it breast pain okay this can happen especially when you're a first time mom i remember when i was now, when I started breastfeeding my young girl, my baby, oh my god, it was so painful. My nipple was paining me seriously. I was, oh, at the point, I was crying, shedding tears. I was even like, which one is more painful between labor pain and then breast, uh, breastfeeding pain, right? It was so painful. The kind of pain that women go through uh, is winning pain. <laughs> Right when you start breastfeeding, I told you now that you're going to experience pain, and when you are winning the baby, you're going to experience pain because by the time you want to stop the baby from breastfeeding, the baby, you know, will not suck the breast again. And or and sometimes also you might not even need to express the breast if you are um, using uh, breast pump. At this time, the breast will engorge and the engorgement will bring her of pain. For some women, they experience cold, uh, fever, you know, at this time. For me, I experience fever, serious ones, so I'm shaking like cold. I think it's a pain that women experience. And hmm, the last kind of pain that women experience is emotional pain. If you're watching me now, you've not experienced emotional pain before, let me know. Emotionally, women are very weak. Um, there are some women that are very strong emotionally. You know, emotional pain, it's so common among even girls, young girls, young ladies, women, wives. We all go through this pain. Maybe your, your, maybe your husband is not treating you well or you feel some things are going wrong. Women experience this pain okay <laughs> uh, but it's my prayer that any pain you experience in now in any phase of life the lord in his mercy make you experience joy yeah it can be painful now but there's always the pain doesn't last forever actually 
the pain doesn't last forever okay i think i should add this to it i forgot to uh, this but now that i remember let me add it to the other pain that women experience is menopausal pain pain during menopause i'm still young <laughs> very young uh but i've seen women that experience pain during menopause this is not to scare you it's not the pain in your body these are pains that are, are common to women and the truth is it's always good to experience them at one phase of life but one thing that is so sure is that you are strong and you should see yourself as a very strong woman at all times don't allow the pain to weigh you down don't allow the pain to make you mess up don't allow the pain to make you lose your dignity i wish you well the lord bless you Please don't forget to like this video and if you haven't subscribed, now is the time to subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe. Bye.